हेलो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज स्वाति देश पांडे टीचर टूडे आई विल बी टेकिंग फ्यू इम्पॉर्टेंट सम्स फ्रॉम फिफ्थ स्टैंडर्ड स्कॉलरशिप मैथमेटिक्स सेक्शन सी स्टूडेंट्स यू ऑल आर अवेयर आई हैव ऑलरेडी अपलोडेड फ्यू वीडियोस सो प्लीज सी ऑल ऑफ देम इन ईच वीडियो आई हैव ट्राइड टू कवर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ सम्स विच आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फ्रॉम एग्जामिनेशन पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू सो प्लीज डोंट स्कीप एनी वीडियो इट विल बी रियरली बेनिफिशियल ओके okay? चलो आगे बढ़ते हैं द फर्स्ट सम विल अपियर ऑन योर स्क्रीन हाउ मेनी टाइम शूड थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन बी एडेड टू थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन टू गेट सम टू दिस सम कैन बी सॉल्व टेकिंग हेल्प ऑफ फ्रैक्शन यस आई अग्री इट शुड बी डन दैट वे बट इन कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम समाइम्स टू सेव टाइम we have to use shortcut methods right so today i am going to share with you a shortcut method for this particular sum see what they have they are saying how many times should 3 upon 15 be added to 3 upon 15 means 1 3 upon 15 is already there to that they want to add 3 upon 15 how many times to get 2 so I have written this way. Three upon fifteen is already there. In that, they want to add three upon fifteen. How many times to get two? So I have written these numbers in this order. Okay. First thing is whatever is already there. Next number is what we need to add multiple times, and this is the ultimate answer what they are expecting from us. Okay. So three upon fifteen, three upon fifteen, and two. I have written in this order. Now I am sharing a shortcut. Start from this fifteen. Multiply with this two. So fifteen into two I am doing first. That is thirty. After that I am doing minus. Whatever is the answer from that I am minusing this number. That is twenty-seven. Then I am doing division. Twenty-seven divided by this number now three. So answer is nine. When students know this shortcut, they arrive at the answer manually within few seconds. I suggest you should never do any sum manually. because the probability of making mistakes is much more in that case okay do a little calculation on paper and then arrive at an answer students many times they have asked this type of question they will change this fraction they will change this number nothing else your method is same you have to follow this method 3 upon 15 pehle tha उसमें थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन कितनी बार एड करना है सो दैट द आंसर इज टू सो आई हैव रिटर्न इन दिस ऑर्डर थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन टू देन मल्टीप्लीकेशन फर्स्ट दिस वे देन सब्ट्रैक्शन का टाइम आता है तो सब्ट्रैक्ट द मिडल नंबर देन डिविजन आंसर इज नाइन दिस कैन बी सॉल्व विद द हेल्प ऑफ फ्रैक्शन आई नो दैट थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन में कितनी बार थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन एड करोगे सो दैट द आंसर इज टू टू मीन्स थर्टी अपॉन फिफ्टीन आउट ऑफ दैट थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन इज ऑलरेडी देर सो हाउ मच ट्वेंटी सेवन अपॉन फिफ्टीन सो ट्वेंटी सेवन को थ्री से डिवाइड करोगे सो आंसर विल बी नाइन बिकॉज थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन थ्री अपॉन फिफ्टीन कितनी बार एड करोगे दैट टाइम यू विल गेट ट्वेंटी सेवन अपॉन फिफ्टीन ऑब्वियसली नाइन टाइम्स सो आंसर इज ट्वेंटी सेवन डिवाइडेड बाय थ्री सो आंसर इज नाइन दिस वे ऑल्सो इट कैन बी डन बट आई फील दिस इज रिलेटिवली इजी फॉर यू टू रिमेम्बर एंड डू ओके करेक्ट दो तीन बार देखोगे ना तो यूल बी क्लियर अबाउट इट आई एम श्योर अबाउट इट राइट चल आगे बढ़ते हैं Students, the next sum I have written on the board. One upon five plus one upon five plus one upon five is equal to box upon fifteen. Find the value of that box. Very easy. 
whatever numbers are available, we will add them first. Here they are like fractions with the same denominator. So our job is very easy. We have to just add the numerators. 1 plus 1 plus 1. 3 upon 5 is the answer. Please don't add this and do 15 here. Huh? Looking at this 15. Please be care careful. Denominator add nahi hota hai. It is same. So it will remain same. Only the numerators will be added. Now is equal to box upon 15. Now whatever numbers are available. Now 5 and 15. Both denominators are available. Which will help us to find out the value of this numerator. Now 5 into how much is 15? 3. So obviously we have to do into 3 in the numerator as well. So the answer is 9. 3 into 3, 9. 5 into 3, 15. So in suppose we need to make this denominator from 5 to 15. We need to multiply this denominator by 3. Whatever we do to the denominator, we have to do to the numerator. Otherwise, the value of the fraction will differ. It will change. That is not allowed. So, we are doing 3 into 3 as well. So, 9. So, 9 is the answer. Isn't it easy? Tell me. Correct? Chalo. Aage badte hai. Students, the next term will appear on your screen. What should be the number if the divisor, quotient and remainder are 14, 18 and 3 respectively? I have purposely taken this sum because this formula many students do not know. They don't know. So I want you to know this formula. This is simply based on formula. But in case you don't know that formula, two marks are unnecessarily be wasted. Really? Correct? So we cannot afford it. So what is the formula? Formula is divisor into quotient plus remainder is equal to dividend. Dividend means number. Okay? Number means dividend. Same name. So here what have they given divisor, quotient and remainder as 14, 18 and 3 respectively. Means divisor is 14, quotient is 18, remainder is 3. Here again we have to follow the Bormas rule. So obviously we need to do this first. 14 into 18 that is 252 two then plus 3 that is 255 Bormas is the concept usme jada bacche wrong karte hai and unnecessarily just because of the order of the operation is not correct, they lose marks. I don't want this to happen in case of you. So I want you to learn this formula. Divisor into quotient plus remainder is equal to the dividend or the number what they are asking. Okay? Chalo. Aage badte hai. I will take one more sum of uh, Bormas. I want you to be very very clear. Chalo. Aage badte hai. See students, I have written the sum on the board. Unlike the earlier question, where we did the multiplication first and multiplication was as it is first. So, the probability of making mistake was relatively less. But in this case, plus is first and then multiplication. Here, Bormas plays a very very important role. Here, even though the multiplication is next, we have to perform this first. So 55 will be as it is. Plus 18 into 3. 54. So answer is 109. If we do not follow this board mass rule. And if we do this 55 plus 18. First. If we do this first. 
this is 73 into 3 if we do later 219 this option will be 1000 percent there and students get this who do not know the Vormas rule and they are very happy option is there so I have got 2 marks no it has to be solved this way this is correct this is wrong got me ok students we will stop here in this video but I promise you I will come with the next video very very soon और हमें और बहुत सारे क्वेश्चंस कवर करने हैं विच आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फ्रॉम एग्जामिनेशन पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू ओके वी आर नॉट सपोज टू लीव एनी स्टोन अनटर्न राइट वी हैव टू डू एवरीथिंग पॉसिबल टू पास विद द फ्लाइंग कलर्स राइट ओके स्टूडेंट्स आई विल कम विद द नेक्स्ट वीडियो वेरी वेरी सून टिल देन स्टडी वेल एंड वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग इज येस यू ऑल नो बाय नाउ एंजॉय स्टडी बाय